Hello, it's Armor with Avi Six Hundred. Back in the last episode, say I'm doing another story, and I've trained up a lot. But first, I want to show you something. It wasn't that, but we'll go with that anyway, because I got to show you the battles here anyway. This battle is one of the more annoying ones if you don't know what to do. Basically, take out the yellow rose at the bottom. Because of that. She has fascination. Goodbye, Link Tech, for Venus. Glad I only had her teaming up with Mars in this one, so she only lost the uh, turn. The other two aren't bad. But they're so not bad, I can beat this without turning Venus back to normal. Just, the only reason I'm having Mercury and Jupiter use Shabbat and Thunder is because, well, Mercury really doesn't have any multi-techs with this team that affect enemies. So I just have them attacking one enemy each and the other is hitting with all enemy attacks. Another battle, another level. Nice. You can see we're around 45 now. This is the minimum you want to be for the... This is actually the last level we need for the end of the game. You need to be at least level 45 to beat the final boss. We're well... We're going to be well over that, probably. We're going to be around 50-ish, I think. If things work the right way. So if you want to stop leveling now, you can. By the way, I'm going to use two confetti on Mercury... And the White Rose, which is going to raise our defense, I'm going to use, finally, on Jupiter. I could use it on Mars or Venus, but it's one of those that it's like any of those three could use it. Anyone with a high offense and low defense, slap it on. And this is what we got, a traveling merchant. And yes, a lot of money. So we're going to stock up on bento sits. I'm going to skip the Nigeria. Hmm. Hmm. I'll get 11 cologne and 10 toy... No, 10 of each cologne toilets. Bath mix I'll fully stock on. I guess I'll dump the rest of it in foundation cream, because you never know when you need defense. And manicures will buy a couple just in case. And so you never know. Excuse my nose, I got something in there. As I was saying, excuse me, my nose is a little stuffy. I've been outside working on something all day, so... Because I kind of have to. Plus, I was receiving a package, so I had to wait for it. So, yeah. Lots of stuff happened. And yes, I am recording this on Friday the 8th, after a monumental grinding session. Gotta love them. Honestly, this week has been one of my busier weeks, because my, my family's been preparing for a yard sale. So there's been a lot of work going on. Which didn't add to a lot of the videos being late, by the way. In fact, this episode might be just slightly past the 3 p.m. deadline, if not a little more past. But it's going to be a little more past, because while I'm recording, it's going to hit 3. So yeah, working all day, got through it. Thank you for finally showing up at me and not being under a glitch. That's the one I wanted to show off, too. This enemy has a tat does have the other tactic you need to be weary of, and I suggest casting the Healing Spray quick. Because this has caused a major amount of problems during my grinding sessions that she uses Illusion. A lot. And she hits a lot. Usually it's only one or two, but I just Healing Spray just to make sure all the main characters are covered. 
I think we got her on this turn. So I'm not going to worry about it. And we're at a point where I can go one character gets turned and still win the fight. Like so. Mars leveled up. Nice. So yeah, I'll be outside after I'm done recording this one working on more stuff. <sighs> so do I go up first or do I go down first? Well, the side after I get into a battle! Yay! Battles! More XP! Come on. Slap. Do it again. And then again. If you're low leveled in this area, you could use your use Jupiter I mean not Jupiter, Venus and Merc and Moon's attack up. Def I think it does defense too, I'm never sure. I gotta find that out one day. I never did look that up. Sometimes you get extra busy, you forget to do things that you want to do or need to. But either way, we're just gonna keep hammering. And ta da. Okay, now we're gonna head down. And up and around. Spiral fire, spiral fire, healing. No, Shab on Thunder. You're gonna shove on Thunder the other person, you're gonna love me bird that one. This fight's an easy one, they don't have any special abilities to worry about other than a whirlwind cut, and they don't do as much damage as the other enemies. So this is the one you really want to abuse if you can't fight the others. This is the one you want to seek out. Note that my team is getting especially high with Link Techs. Mercury alone is at 90, and we're just going to keep going up. I think Moon's at 160, about. And yeah, we're still on non-stop. I mean, Chibi Usa is the queen of Tex. Because that's all we farmed her for, because, well, that's the only thing she's good at, besides healing. I mean, hey, first turn healing, I love it. Hmm? Oh, are you awake now? Who who are you? I am called Sin. If you keep quiet, I won't do anything to you. You think I'll do what one of the bad guys tells me? Oh. <laughs> huh? Ah, sorry for laughing. I have a little brother, too. Do you like your sister? Eh, well... My little brother is cute. I think I would do anything for the sake of my brother. Usagi... She isn't like that. She always steals my food and uses my games, and you always steal your brother's pets. She does those awful things. But but she was always there when I was sick. You want to be disobedient, she worries about me. That's strange. Though she's a bad sister. You never said he was a bad sister. Do you like her? Don't speak so badly of my sister. And she is stunned for a moment, is in thought. The sailor sent you are coming. Eh? Sailor Moon is? The sent you are coming! The sent you are coming! Alright, I'm going right away. Shingo kun, sleep some more. This time, it'll be for a bit longer. Ding. First, we shall strike Sailor Moon with an illusion. 
which I'm sure is not going to work, but we're not going that way yet, because I don't want to... Plus, I'm trying to find another enemy we have not fought yet. There's one more enemy we have not seen yet, and I'm trying to find it. Because I do kind of want to explain that one. Meanwhile, we're just going to take out some enemies, get some XP, and walk away. If you really wanted to, and you were really serious, you could grind to level 99 right here. Before you say I'm crazy, I've done this. It's not as bad as you think. They give some good XP. I mean, this is a decent area to get XP with them. And that would be my phone. Being itself. So, yeah. Battle over. And is this the battle that we want? By the way, this is no Kagia. Yes, they put her in. I thought you would have liked to see her. But yeah, I had to show her off. This is the battle that I want to show. She's not that bad, especially if, if you have Mars. But make sure you avoid Tempest. On that, standard battle. You've seen every eight battle in this area. I'm happy. I'm pleased. Let's go on. So I did what I wanted to do here. Let's just check this area to the north of us out. I think we're done opening chests in this game, but you're never sure. And there's evil energy, so we can't go in that door. And yes, you can go back if you accidentally tap that thing. Or, on purpose, if you're trying to go back. Yes! We're almost done, though. Make sure we're healed up. We're all at level 46 now. That's pretty good. Here's some moon pudding. I'm going to use that to heal up. There we go. And up. Excuse me. And we're in an illusion again. Somehow space seems to be getting all distorted. Hmm? What's this? I think he's about to describe the pudding of relativity again. Everybody vanished too. Guys, where are you? Sailor Moon. Oh, no. You have been abandoned by your friends. No way! I believe in all of them. Besides, that distorted world is a creation of yours. <laughs> Perhaps. But how you find this world, I wonder... Yusako, I'm home. Welcome back, Mamo-chan. Hmm? Where's my cute lady? She was with Momo-chan today. She came back from playing in Dreamland all exhausted. Let me see. Nya, nya. Hmm. Pegasus. With our lady like that, it certainly is quieter. Isn't she my kid, though? And who's Pegasus? You're right. <laughs> How was it, Sailor Moon? Uh, I... If you hand over the Mystic Silver Crystal, I can grant you the fate you just saw. That's wrong! That's really wrong! Because everyone doesn't want to change their fate. People of the Black Moon, for example, were saddened to have their fate changed. I 
I see. At any rate, you don't seem to intend to hand over the mystic silver crystal. In that case, I have no choice. I thought we could sell this by talking together. You don't care what will befall Shingo-kun. Come to the back room and let's fight there. Now she didn't care. She won't even be here, you lying thief. Sailor Moon, what's the matter? It's okay. Let's hurry. I can feel Shingo near. And yes, we're all at level 46. We're all fully healed. We're ready to do this. Let's... It's Shingo! Yay! I've been waiting for you, Sailor Mars. Nurgle! I'm glad we could meet again, Sailor Mercury. Nabu! I thought you would come for sure, Sailor Jupiter. Marduk! Ho, ho, ho! It's been a while, Sailor Venus. Ishtar! Sin, give Shingo back to me! You're as strong as always, Sailor Moon! So it's a gathering all the Opposito Senshi, right? How was it? Our illusion, I mean. Bet you enjoyed it. The illusion? No way! You know we showed you the life you wish for? Our patience has limits! That fate is disgusting! We're not weak like you are! Dang! My my, you're not weak after seeing yourself in that illusion? You violated a taboo by changing destinies the way you wanted! It's not too late, though. Turn those destinies back to normal. Too bad for you, we happen to like those destinies. Surrender, Opposito Senshi. Or in the name of the moon? I'll punish you. Hmm. Now is the time to settle the score. No, it's not. It'll be next episode. Consider this to be our final battle. I hope you had fun, and I'll see you on the next one for Battle of the Final.